Hi, I'm Scott. Today we're going to talk about moss in your lawn on Dad It Yourself. So moss has taken over my yard this season. I mean, I normally get a little patch right through here every year. As you can see, it's one o'clock in the afternoon and no sun here and there probably won't be at all. Um, but now the moss is like all through here around this corner up into here. I mean, you can see it in the landscape bed. And I was up on the roof the other day and you can probably see the moss all along the gutter there, but both of these two gutters are full of giant moss balls. I'll have to get up there and show you guys those a little later. But as we go around the corner and we still move into where the sun gets during the afternoon, there's moss all through here. It's working its way out into the lawn. I mean, it's come out all the way out into here and then all the way down and there's a giant patch way over here let me show you look at this pretty much where this is all kind of brown there's just giant patches of moss all through this area here so it's really taken over this year i don't know if it's because we had less snow and more rain or unseasonably warm, but it's killing me. So the backyard is a whole other story. I sometimes usually get some like right over in this corner and then this corner doesn't get a lot of sun. But if you look over here, you can already see it. And I did the moss test last year actually in this corner. You can see this huge piece right here and all through here, this is all moss. And then we've got patches spread throughout the lawn over there look at this giant one right here huge um, it's starting to yellow up because it's starting to get a little bit more sun but it's going to take me a while yeah back here this whole corner this is all moss through here and into here and then i've got this patch over here i mean it has really taken over this lawn we're going to have to really attack it this year so what are we going to do well we're going to mow first all right, I mowed this. The sun's going, look at there's actually some sunshine right there now, but it's uh, six o'clock in the evening. So that's the only time the sun gets over right here on this part of the lawn, six o'clock at night. So that looks really good actually. <laughs> I'm pretty impressed. This was my first mow of the year, so I can't complain. And tomorrow is Operation Moss Killer. All right, so it's been about 10 days since that last clip. We've had about a 15 to 20 degree temperature increase in our neighborhood, and it's actually starting to brown out this moss, but it's still there. Now, if you watched any of my last videos, you've noticed that I usually do spot treatment using a liquid application of Lily Miller's Moss Out. Well, this year I'm gonna try this Scott's Moss X, and I'm gonna use this spreader. My infestation is so bad this year, I literally have to treat it as if I'm fertilizing my lawn by doing it everywhere. So let's get started on that. So that bag was perfect for my lawn. I'm gonna let this sit for four or five days, turn my sprinklers on, let it water it in, and then I'm gonna come back with a force on Monday with a dethatcher. All right, so this dethatcher did a number on that moss. I mean, it ripped it right out of the ground. It was all dead and black from the uh, Scott's Moss X. Um, I gotta run it again. I didn't get close enough to the edge right here, so there's still a little bit right there. And then over here, you'll see it's in my planter bed. I'm just gonna get some liquid spray and we'll just spray that out. So, look at that. No more moss, all gone. So I did a little raking and as you can see, that dethatcher 
just took all that moss right out of there, just ripped it right out of the ground. So if you don't have a power to thatcher, a metal leaf rake, a stone rake, or even a dethatcher rake like this is very effective in removing the moss. Now that I've gotten rid of all the moss, I can start my spring routine with this lawn. That means overseeding, fertilizer, and turn those sprinklers on. I should have a lush green lawn in just a couple of weeks. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions about how to remove moss from your lawn, put those down below in the comments section. I'd love to hear from you. Speaking of comments, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you do, hit the bell for notifications. I've got some videos over here you may be interested in. Subscribe button's right down here. Thanks for watching. Dad it yourself.